Hey, Lucas. Having any luck? No. Just... I've been thinking about other stuff, actually. Stuff such as... You know, Gabriel, the ocelots, people getting wither sickness and amnesia. <sighs> Don't get me wrong. I'm glad I came with you. I just... I'm just scared for everyone. For them, for us, for everybody, really. You're a good friend, Lucas. The fact that you're always thinking about others, it says a lot. Well, I like my friends. I guess that's why they're friends in the first place, right? Either that, or you like that they say nice things about you. <laughs> Ivor, on the other hand, I think his only friends were books. I guess being an angry loner leaves you a lot of time to read. <laughs> Tell me about it. How to train your slime, the various uses of mushroom stew, potionology volume 24? Are any of them the enchanting book? I don't think so. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. That first night we all spent together? Look, we might be spread thin, but we're all still a team. That's how teams work. Hey, you almost said teamwork. See? We're still funny. And we can still get things done. I guess being split up just means we can be in more places at once, right? Kinda like the wither storm. Let's just forget that metaphor. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't tried to fight those cursed witches, he could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. He was just doing what I asked. It wasn't his fault we got separated. Not really. Is that supposed to make me feel better? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. This Ivor character, I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the Wither Monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? What do you remember? I seem to recall that Ivor was better with potions than people. And he, he... Keep going. Ah, nothing else is coming. Besides the whole Ivor being a jerk thing. Potion of blindness. Potion of dullness, potion of nausea, none of these will help me. Jesse, am I going to be all right, or is this just who I am now? Always struggling to remember what I was. Don't worry. We're going to find a way to fix you. You and Petra and everyone else the Witherstorm affected. But to do that, you'll need to destroy the command block, will you not? So that's exactly what we'll do. You never stop fighting. I admire that. Reuben, what are you doing? <coughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before. Stay away from lava. <coughs> Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Well, it's a good thing I still have one. From, like, ages ago. Like it was made for it. Let's 
see what this sucker does. a secret passage in a house nobody ever visits. More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine, but the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there. We'll head down and see what we can find. Whoa. What is all this? Ha! Huh, incredible. He's gathered them all in one place. Gathered... what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there. Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. I think those are gas tears. These gas tears, they're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, I'm taking this really cool rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Uh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Am I crazy? Or is this a sea lantern? Ah! The very same one the Order built all those years ago. Oh, we were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? Prismarine crystals? You've got to be kidding me. These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. Ice. I've only ever heard of this stuff. So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the ice plain spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. So why does Ivor have the treasures of the Order of the Stone? Did he steal them? No, 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 no. We... we let him keep them when we split up. You let him keep your treasures? Frankly, Jesse, it's a long story. So why does Ivor have the treasures of the Order of the Stone? Did he steal them? No, 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 no. We... we let him keep them when we split up. You let him keep your treasures. Frankly, Jesse, it's a long story. No way. Is that what I think it is? Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh. Alas, yes. The only thing that remains 
of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind. Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Looks like a regular hopper. That's hooked up to a bunch of Fredstone circuitry. Man, Ivor sure does love his puzzles. Hmm. Five slots. Ender Dragon Egg. So cool. Let's try it here. Tears. Let's try them here. Prismarine crystals into the hopper. Packed ice. Let's put it here. did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations. Everything I needed was in your stories. Nice work, Jesse. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. the stars the ender dragon with replica ender crystals and all wow i always wondered what it looked like hmm no way out hmm interesting Looks like a banner about TNT. That's a sword. Well, a banner of a sword anyway. weapons. I pressed all four, but it isn't doing anything. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. We're missing something here, Soren. And I have a feeling the key might be locked in that head of yours. I have a key locked in my head? What I'm saying is, I think you need to tell me about the Ender Dragon battle. Oh! Ha. Huh. If only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. <laughs> So, the Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. 
the second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. That was absolutely amazing! They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. Hmm, wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? There's another door? Soren, tell me the story again. Certainly. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle. Sorry, maybe the short version this time? Well, all right. I destroyed one crystal with my bow, the next using a TNT shockwave, the third with Eligard's redstone cannon, the fourth from upon the dragon itself. And then Gabriel poked it dead with a sword. How was that? Better. Thanks. Hey, Reuben, give me a boost, will ya? actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore he was going to dispose of them. Soren, what is all this? What in the world is going on here? Jesse, this isn't this isn't what it looks like. Our story, uh, the, the story, it's it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. So what really happened, Soren? If you didn't destroy the Ender Crystals, I, I can't we swore never to speak of it. I think it's time to start talking. I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything. We used that damned command block. You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm 
afraid so. Understand. When I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster, we could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. So, I concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated the dragon. And the rest is history. Why would you do that? You lied. Even to your closest friends. All I can say is... I was a fool. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? Ivor. How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. Yeah. I think you are. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? But Ivor... Why? You knew about all of this, didn't you, Ivor? Of course I knew about it. I was in the Order from the very beginning. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard... They agreed to keep this a secret. How conniving of us. And you... You agreed to stay quiet, too. In exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jessie discovered the truth on her own. So this whole thing, this wither you unleashed, has all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. And how is that any better? You reveal their lies at the expense of the world itself. Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. Look, right now, Axel is out there somewhere, facing that monster you created. So however we got here, we need to move on. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. So, the enchanting book. What do we do with it? You craft a weapon, then put it on an anvil. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor? I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. <laughs> 